European news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. Roger Goodell is not having a good year. First he let the NFL anthem protests get out of control. He literally let the inmates run the asylum and the owners are furious. Then the owners refused to extend his contract until he figured a way out of the mess. Some, like Jerry Jones, gave Roger the easy way to save his job and the league from ruin, make a new rule that outlaws players taking an E. This is not a civil rights issue for the NFL penalizes players for nearly everything. They have rules that govern every small action and what you can wear and they can easily make one more. And until they do this is going to keep happening. According to Briet Bart the Monday night football ratings are in and they spell doomed for Rogers' future with the league. You should have signed your contract extension before Kaepernick ruined the league, Roger. It's too late now. Monday's Packers and Lions game got a 7.6. This beats last year as week 9. On the eve of the election when no one in the country cared about the NFL. Last year was the lowest rated week 9 in history and this year just beat it. What a debacle. The story was later corrected to reflect an odd game in 2007, but it is still a debacle. Either it is the second lowest rated week 9 game in history or it is the lowest. Talk about two bad choices for the NFL. There is a slight silver lining to the story. This week's game is actually up 6 points from last week's game. But as last week's game was no ratings bonanza, it is not really something for Goodell to be proud of. No, Roger has a simple choice to make. Door number 1 saves his job and the whole league. Door number 2 leads to ruin for both. Choose wisely Roger, you are running out of time, time.